I was watching TV the other day, and they had a couple Star Wars movies on. They must have, uh, have uh, done some enhancements on them because, man, they were so crystal clear. It was really fun watching them uh, on TV. And uh, anyway, so one of those movies was, I think it was The Attack of the Clones. And uh, in that movie, uh, they traveled to a planet called uh, Coruscant. Or Coruscant, I guess that's how you say it. And uh, this is a planet that was uh, completely terraformed. There was nothing but city on the entire planet. And actually, I wanted to put a picture of that up on the video, but I thought I might get in trouble for it, so I didn't do it. Really cool looking. But it definitely made me think of Venus, and I think Venus is that way. I think Venus is completely covered from top to bottom, uh, side to side, with, with humanity. I think this planet is entirely uh, terraformed. And uh, I've said quite a few times you see all these white lines on Venus. And, you know, what are they? I mean, what are they? You, picture after picture after picture, these white lines that stretch out, straight lines go every direction over and under and below and above and whatever. You know, what do you think those are? Well, you know, we've discovered on my channel that these are structures they're white structures and they stretch out i don't know why they do that i mean i guess that's why they're alien right i mean they can do whatever they want they don't have to tell me what it's all about but i did discover that yes they are they are structures and there are so many pictures like this in the archive that show them over and over and over in fact every single one that i th i think that i've seen show these white lines going everywhere and those are buildings but make no mistake the, they're not the only buildings I mean you have what's between all the white lines look at this uh, construction in the left corner here top left corner now for whatever reason uh, it's rectangular and those are white structures or light colored and you know, it's not just Venus. They have these kinds of lines on Mars. We've seen that on my channel. And uh, But the difference between Venus and Mars is there's so much more of it on Venus. And that's why I said I think Venus is far ahead of, of Mars in, uh, in, their, in their development. And, and I've also said that Mars is millions and millions and millions of years old. Not Mars, civilization on Mars. And yet, here on Venus, it's even farther ahead than that. Uh, there have to be literally trillions of people living here. Don't ask me about all the infrastructure. I have no idea. And by the way, folks, if I start coughing, give me a break. I managed to catch a cold, and uh, I've been trying to wait for it to clear up a little bit so I could narrate this thing, but I can tell I'm going to have a problem here probably. But anyway, yeah, there are trillions of people living here. I mean, I don't know how many people it would take to coat a planet. <laughs> it's like paint, right? How many people does it take to coat a planet? And just like Mars, they it's just what you see on the surface is just the surface. Uh, what goes down they below, I mean they you know, they build on top of each other. It's it's all layered just like what we've seen on Mars. Again, only a lot more. Look at these structures. I mean and look at the layout. You know, that's another thing. I've been so worried lately about showing, um, uh, you know, image artifacts. And I had a series of videos a while back uh, when I was more of an amateur than I am now, which also happened to be some of the most watched videos that I have that were all completely wrong. I was wrong, wrong, wrong. It was all image artifacts. And so I have this fear of that happening again. I, I just, uh, you know, really don't want to go there. But when you start looking at the layout on how things are put together and these long straight rows of structures that's just like Mars, we've seen very clearly uh, they're not image artifacts. These are 
structures and they pack them in together and they put them in rows uh, and and I think these rows uh, you know follow the terrain uh, sometimes you'll see it dip down or go up uh, whatever um, but the point is, is that there's uh, <laughs> Uh, row after row after row of structure after structure and I, I wish you know all of these buildings uh, one way or the other all look the same I mean they're either a short cube shaped or a tall rectangular and there's such a variety of shapes too you know uh, you look at these these little buildings that are in rows and white rows and right next to these what appear to be skyscrapers right these rows of white buildings look like little skyscrapers there's a great big fat huge building very near it I don't get it uh, it's just the variety of sizes uh, you know like I said I don't know I I don't live there I'm not alien it's just uh, a variety of, of buildings that uh, I guess they put them there. Uh, they're there for us to ponder. You know, all we can do is look at our two-dimensional pictures and our in our black and white. Uh, you know, I had been wishing that there were color colored pictures of cities on Mars. Uh, I've been wishing that for a long time. I finally got one. So if I wish that long enough for a, a Venus city, maybe someday we'll get a color picture of a Venus city. I don't think so though. I think all of these. Uh, satellite images are in black and white but you know I don't know I don't know everything uh, because I'm an amateur and the other thing is I have a full-time job so uh, to uh, spend all the time that I need to research this stuff uh, and find the pictures you know I, a lot of times I'll find a picture that's something I want to show and it looks fantastic and then when I go in on it it completely pixelates or you know so I can't use every one that I see but I know what I'm looking at when I see them. And I think some of you who watch my videos know that too. I'm sure when you see a picture that looks, uh, you know, doesn't maybe doesn't look like anything special, but you look at it and you say, ah, that's construction right there. I know it is. That's what happens with, with experience. So I'm just trying to fight back the cough here. I'm almost through with this. <laughs> Oh geez, I you know nothing worse than this cold. This has been the worst cold ever. Um, and here's a great example. Here's a great big buildings. There are clusters of them in these little tiny rows of white buildings. And uh, between the rows of the white buildings, you have uh, you know blocks and blocks of of more construction. It's like every other place. Well, I'm not going to say every other place, but it's, again, it's like Mars. Uh, Titan we've seen that this really intense uh, population this the density is is unfathomable um, and then to know that they're layered as well uh, it's just uh, it's, it's really hard to get your mind around I don't think it's a place I'd like to live but I show as hell would like to go see it thanks for watching you guys